Hi everyone, welcome back to another video. And before I start, uh, I want to get into a topic real quick. So, uh, recently there was a challenge announced, or a community challenge basically, saying that um, we need to get... It's a community challenge where literally you gather clips and you make an edit. And the edit gets sent into them, and then it can be won first, second or third to get a prize. And I thought, why, as it's a community challenge, why not take my community's clips and put them together in a community edit showing what how amazing this Descenders community is. So if you haven't already, uh, I'm going to show you how to do this now. If you can go to a Google Drive or get yourself a Google Drive because it's free and when you're on Google Drive you have 15 gigabytes worth of storage to upload. So basically what you want to do is get your Google Drive ready. Um, I'll bring it across now. So yeah, once you have your Google Drive ready, upload the file by pressing new and then file upload. Choose the video file that you have. Hopefully it's 1080, uh, 720p or above because I need a, bit, a good quality. Then once it's there, get a shareable link and then all you have to do is copy that link that it gives you into my Discord. So basically I'll switch over to that now. So when you go over to my Discord, come into my Discord and then scroll down until you see the clip section and then just paste it in there. And it's probably the best way to do it because I can take that raw file and put it into an editing software and string it all together to make a very nice edit. So what I'm going to be talking about today is my frequently asked questions. Questions that I get asked quite often and pretty much every video, if not, um, then I get asked them at least every week. Um, and maybe even every day. So yeah, um, so basically the first one I'm going to go over because it is asked a lot is modded maps aren't on Xbox. So the bike park section isn't modded maps because they're not modded anymore because they've been baked into the game. They've literally been put in fully and that is basically what has happened. All of the modded maps, well the one modded map that was actually a modded map was the Stoker Bike Park, but that has now been bought by Rage Squid, um, and it's no longer a modded map because it's been put into the game. So Xbox do not have modded maps because you do not have a mod IO section. If you did, then you would have modded maps. So uh, the only way you can get modded maps is only by the Steam copy of the game. At the moment, only the Steam copy of the game has access to modded maps. So literally, all that you will get is bike parks. Modded maps is not for consoles. Mods aren't really even for consoles at all. Uh, Xbox Game Pass for the PC doesn't have it because it's an Xbox Game Pass. It's not linked to Steam in any way. Um, and there isn't really mods for it properly. So the only way you're going to get modded maps is with a Steam copy of the game on a PC. So modded maps are not possible on Xbox currently. Another one that I get asked quite often is, how'd you get that bike? Or what bike is this? Or how'd you get that bike? Is literally asked every single video. Um, it's even asked on the videos that I explain how I get those bikes. So basically I have made four different videos on m how to get bikes or how to get items in the game. I have got how to? F I think I've got five actually. I'll put them up on screen now. So basically, all of these videos that I have on my YouTube channel explain exactly how to get the bikes. There is no other way, but apart from the ones that are explained in the video, is this is a hundred percent how you get these bikes. No other way. There's no need to fucking ask anymore because you keep doing it and it's really annoying. If people come into my Discord and ask from the video that they've seen, explaining how to do it. Same with a Tron bike or a Lux bike. I have explained in several different videos how to get the bike, and you just don't seem to listen. It is, it it's sort of like you see that you have to put in effort to get the bike and then you're like oh I don't want to do that how do you get the bike like you it you have to put an effort into this game to actually do it so yeah if you want a luxe bike or you want any bike or you want any sort a certain be uh, piece of gear I have explained it in that video the only thing that I haven't explained which I will do now which is fair enough is the purple gear set the purple descenders gear set the gold uh, Descenders gear set and the Rainbow Descenders gear set are all done from doing a career run. So when you do uh, with the first career, if you go from the Highlands to the Peaks in one run, that's not dying in between and com being completely out. One entire run where you go from start to finish, you will get the purple gear set and you'll get the gold gear set. Same with Career Plus, go from deserts to glaciers and do a full run of that complete straight to the boss jump then that will give you the rainbow outfit. 
and that's how you get it basically. If you're on Xbox or you're on uh, PC Game Pass or just on PC in general, it is it's kind of it's a lot of people say that they've seen me, but they probably haven't because a lot of the time, not a lot of people see me, and when they do, uh, they just think they see me and it's not. So basically, um, there is. A, if you have a torrent of this game, an illegal ver version of this game, you didn't pay for it or whatever, it is an illegal version of this game, technically, because it's a torrent, unless you live in Russia, and then it's not illegal. But yeah, if you have torrented this game uh, under a certain piracy company, you will have the name Descender. If it's just Descender, the name just says Descender, not THE Descender, it's not me, okay? So it is some random person that isn't me, so you can stop saying, oh, I've seen you and you did this. Like someone came into my Discord and had a right go at me and said, oh, you're rubbish and whatever. Because he went up to someone called Descender with a full white outfit on, probably literally just installed the game. He did a backflip and landed it. And the other person did a backflip and died. So basically he said I was shit because I did that. But it wasn't even me anyway. So he didn't need to have a go at me in the first place. So basically just stop asking those sort of questions. Um... So the thing with rep, people saying, "Oh, I've got, I've got 50k and I haven't got anything." Basically, that total rep that's always at the bottom of your screen, in the lobby or anywhere, well, apart from when you're actually doing a career run, is not the it will not give you a bike that's not how it works i have explained it in several different videos so when you're doing a run and a lot of people come by my stream on monday and they see me do it and they get they see me get my 250k rep and i finish and it gets people items because i like helping out the community and that's a good way to do it so basically when you do this when you have the total rep at the bottom when you're in the desert, it will always be that static number. It never dynamically moves. It will just be a static number that will change each time that your rep collects together. So that rep, when you're in the desert or you're doing a career run in general, that is your rep that will get you bikes and will get you clothes and whatever. So that rep there will get you items. It's not anything to do with any other rep. It is only that bit of rep. So you can stop saying I have 275k rep I haven't got anything I've got 50k rep and I haven't got anything that is not how it works I've just explained to you this very second that that is not how it works I'm sorry if I'm sounding angry or whatever but that is just not how it works I get it asked pretty much every video that I make on it explaining exactly how you do it and people are just like oh no, well, you must be wrong because I haven't got anything but I am telling you this is exactly what has happened so that is the reason how how you actually get stuff and the reason that you don't have stuff is because that's your total rep i have 20 million rep i think i've got 21 million rep in my total but that that i have every item in the game but that is from getting rep in different sessions so i have 20 million rep and i have every item in the game a lot of people don't have every item in the game and are in close proximity to that because they don't put it they gather their rep in very low amounts but they get it a lot so they just have a lot of rep, but it's not a full thing. So yeah, I that is just how it works. And hopefully that clears up all the probably frequently asked questions. I've even got a section in my Discord that is called FAQ, which means frequently asked questions, where I've basically said everything about uh, everything that I get frequently asked. And one other thing, and I'm very sorry to say, but I'm not in contact with the devs. I don't even think they know I exist. Um, I don't even think they know I put out videos basically so yeah um, they don't know I exist so I don't have any information on when certain releases are gonna happen or when there's an update or anything I don't have any connection with them to find out this sort of information I wish I did because that would be really cool but I don't and I'm very sorry but yeah um, Thank you guys very much for watching and giving me all the support. You've got me to 2,000 subscribers. I can't thank you lot enough. Um, if we actually get this community challenge done and we get a sick video out of it and we win, I will give those free Steam copies away to all of you guys because I don't need them. Um, and it will just be great. So yeah, thank you guys very much for watching. I will see you lot later. Have a great day.